Uh, I'm an investor in HMO. I've got a holiday let and a buy to let. Um, I'm looking to develop my HMO portfolio. Um, just wanted to really come and speak to some of the experts and get some tips really on, on how to navigate that. Um, I made a lot of mistakes on my first HMO. Massive problems with, uh, with builders, um, delays on the project, and it, you know, it, costs, it ended up costing me a lot more than it should have. There's some good stuff um, in some of the seminars about um, you know, things like Section 21, about using quantity surveyors and uh, stuff like that for, for, for doing your bills. I, I probably tried to do a bit too much self-management first time around. It's the standing on the shoulders of giants, so, so you don't want to break, you don't want to be in a position where, you, where you're breaking ground on your own. You really want to be in a position where you're using the experience of some of these, ex, these, these, these people that have done it before. Um, I, I, I think it's totally invaluable. I, th I think the first time I did it, maybe I was a little bit too arrogant in my own ability. That might have been why I made so many mistakes, because I, sh I shouldn't have. So I, I'm, this time I'm really, when I, when I start doing my next, I'm really going to stick close to some experience to help me navigate and, and get them done. Some of the questions that are getting asked, I'm not necessarily even from, you know, from me, but from some of the other people that are attending, um, I think really, really important, and, I, and I've actually signed up for some training that was before this show um, to reignite. I've, I've taken some training already. I'm, I'm, I'm recovering some of that training to, to make sure that I do it, that, that I do it right the second time, and get some good people um, that can that can help me.